officers in place to make the vote for the uh, directors. That makes a good sense. So, so the yeah. first step is Kelly is going to make a motion to to approve um, the, the officers. officers. It just uh, helps doing it. And do way. we do we have a second to approve the motion for the uh, five officers as de designated president, CEO, and treasurer, vice president, and secretary? Uh, do we have a second to approve those officers? Yes. Okay. So uh, to approve the officers, uh, Rado has seconded. it. And uh, let's go ahead and, and vote. Um, uh, at this point, it would be um, by the board to appoint the officers, and only member of the board would be Rado. So right. do you approve the five officers as designated? Yes, I do. Okay. So that's approved. So therefore, the officers can then, in turn, uh, we would be entitled to vote and uh, nominate the five directors. So what I will do is I will go ahead and nominate uh, the five directors as designated being Rado Dvorsky, Neil Flaxman, Amy Flaxman, uh, Kelly Johnson, and Mark Spitaleri uh, to be the um, be the five directors. I'll nominate them. Do we have a second to uh, elect those uh, directors? Uh, Neil Flaxman has uh, seconded to uh, nominate uh, the five directors. And do we have a vote of the officers present um, uh, with regard to approving the directors? Uh, are you uh, approving and voting in favor of the uh, five directors as designated yourself? Neil and Amy Wa uh, Flaxman, myself, and Mark uh, Spilleri. Yes. Okay. And motion you is. also uh, approve the I election. Motion. And I will also uh, approve. So by unanimous vote, we are electing the board. So moved. So, so approved. moved. Uh, Neil seconded that uh, with the vote. Uh, all approved. So the directors uh, will become the directors of Avant Garde Imports, Inc. Uh, in addition, uh, we prepared. Uh, uh, well, in, in the minutes, we've also talked about the, the corporation being authorized to borrow certain monies from Neil Flaxman sure. to elect officers and directors as agreed by the corporation. Um, is there anything else? So we've done, we've so, done but, yeah, the directors. So in order to do, so let's, let's get to the specifics. So this okay. was a, um, entering an exhibit, a minutes of annual board meeting of Avant Garde Inc. This exhibit was, um, made and, and, um, Created originally, Rado, right? You had already the board had already prior decided to approve the loan of money. The significant right. difference here is is that what we're looking to do is um, again capture that initial loan, two hundred and fifty thousand, along with the bootstrap that Neil Flaxman is currently providing to get to Series A's funding for that stage of growth. So um, the initial motion will be to get a loan line of credit for Avant Garde Inc. Uh, in, the, in the amount of hopefully $250,000. Um, we'll be looking at Wells Fargo as our primary bank, but no, Rada, you have Comerica. Comerica. So we're, the motion is to open the account at Comerica with bootstrap funds from Neil. Where's your eraser? You don't have one. Can I use this? Oh, just, yeah. Go ahead. That's fine. Okay. So the motion now is for... Uh, and while you're doing that, Neil, uh, pursuant to the minutes of the annual meeting of shareholders, uh, it's... It's listed that the shareholders were present, being Rado Dvorsky, number of shares, 700,000. Um, I am a shareholder also, though it's not listed here. Uh, in the amount of 10% because the shares haven't been issued. Um, and Well, then uh, how, if it hasn't been issued, then how can you have shares? Well, because uh, a lot of things haven't been formalized. But this is the, our opportunity. Okay, I'll go ahead and change this page. I'll put down 100,000 and we'll, I, we'll do that. Please. Okay. But don't have to do it right now. Okay. Okay. So the so shareholders are uh, present. Wait, let me, let me, let me declare. So there's 1 million shares of Avant Garde, correct? Correct. And Rado is what? 100% shareholder today. Correct. Okay. For the purposes of discussion, now Kelly wants to make a motion. First, I thought about the loan. 
we were on the loan, and while you were we doing can, your handiwork there, I was just interjecting. Yep. Sure. So we'll get to, I have, you know, all of the valuation and the vote on shares, but I think we need to take care of business first, mm -hmm. right? We, ha we need to operate and figure out the source of the funds. The valuation says how many shares people get, right? Today, pre-valuation, it's called pre-valuation funding, right? We say, okay, how much is Tatra T avant-garde with its burdens and its pluses, whatever it is, what it's worth today? Pre-investment money. Mm -hmm. We invest money, how much is it worth then? At the end of this meeting, I have a check in my pocket and I take it out. We open up a bank with bank account with Comerica. Now it's worth more because, you know, again, we're in the red and we can't pay our lease today. Does that make sense? So what we're trying to establish first is what is the, you know, I was going to go down. So a motion for Neil to pay Olin Commercial, Commercial Realty, Realty Group for the sum of 11,677.88. Right. All right, this is coming out of my pocket directly to Olin because we don't, it's, it's Veterans Day. We don't have the opportunity to go to the bank and put it in his name or the corporate name. So, but again, this is kind of business as unusual. We're trying to make We're business, trying to formalize. business and, and, as usual. And I, and I, would, uh, and I would move uh, to authorize uh, uh, Neil Flaxman as, uh, as officer and director uh, on behalf of the corporation to advance the funds to the landlord uh, to be able to maintain the tenancy of contingent business operations. on an approved lease that the board approves of the terms of the C lease. Correct, and the lease will be able to be reviewed prior to, yeah. uh, if not submission of our funds, negotiation of the funds. We will make sure that yeah. we have a signed lease before they negotiate the funds. Although the funds may be tendered today in good faith, in good to faith, maintain the tenancy. To maintain and the to tenancy, to call but off I have to have sale. an approval of lease. Right, we have to see what it is. Uh, uh, you know, uh, they're raising our rent $4,000 a month. You know, we don't know, right? Yeah. So let's just do that. We're good. So the motion is made. All in favor, say aye. 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 Passed. So next item, budget, real briefly. Um, in in the minutes, did, did he give you a copy of this? No, that, that's all. Uh, that's that's a yeah, of what now? Of, of the document that we Do I you drafted. That we I'll, wrote I'll, up. I'll give it to everybody. Here here were the min no, minutes. No 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 not those. This is what we were just discussing. Could you have that, Toronto, please? I know, but again, the one I wanted was this one. That's that's coming up next. Well, it's kind of a guidebook for everyone to review as okay. we're going. Does okay. that make sense? Yeah. Here's your copy of that. Super. Okay. Sorry, Rado. So we're, this one. Yes. Is it okay if we yeah. we'll circulate that? I gave you one. Here's uh, one more for everybody else. Did you give one to Rado? That's his. Yeah. Okay. So again, when it so it kind of outlines in here what we just discussed, right? So we're on expenses right now, and, and I need, so I the need budget, one more print out of this. I have four, but go ahead. Let me just print that one. Excuse me. So the budget basically, as I stated before. Um, Mark, Rado, right, the, the lease is disproportionately high. So if our sales go up, the lease is fine, but right now at the sales we have, so um, maintaining, what is, how much is the lease per month? It's about 2,500. Plus utilities. Plus utilities, 3,000. So say. great deal, right, for the space we have. How many square feet is it? You know, we have actually, because we have this top floor, it's probably... Yeah. But Over it's not all utilizable, it's not all finished. Yeah, well, right? that's what we need to discuss too. So the budget is that. So we're playing about a dollar a foot. Yeah. It's a little less, like 90 cents. Yeah. It's, it's, it is not bad. Yeah, but the problem is, is that, you know, if you walk around, the majority of the square footage is not used, right? There's no tea here. There's, you know, water, gym equipment, offices that are partially occupied. The idea is we need to get not the board members here, we need to get the workforce here, the marketing, the sales, the finance, the people who are going to grind this into a machine. And we need them right here and right there and right there so we can be, is it done yet? I asked you to, you know, place a call, get the order, get it delivered. Is it done yet? I mean, that's, 
that's how businesses run, generally speaking. So that's the key is I'm requesting as part of this to outline a budget and for the board to approve how the space is utilized so that our dollar square foot is It makes sense. What is the, and I know you originally got this primarily for ABC, but also to store some stuff. Yes, absolutely. Do we still need to store stuff here or is that going to go away or what? What's Which the, stuff? The, the water, water or tea or well, both no the, everything is stored here the equipment we're trying to sell it right that's eight nine thousand dollars that's uh, Milos's equipment uh, and uh, water is gonna go you know it's going today it's going like six eight five so it's gonna so, go so this is what I'm saying the board will agree on the duration for that stuff to get out of here right how long it's gonna take us to get the crap out because I believe that we can utilize this space Effectively, mm -hmm. okay, that was sort of yeah the question, the bottom line question. Right. Yeah. So can, can remember what I said about this place remember what I said about our budget. I said disproportionately our, our rent of expenses we need, by by either increasing the other pieces of the pie like sales or decreasing this is important. Well, it's difficult to decrease this. Rado doesn't feel comfortable with a sublet right now. Well, it depends who you want to have here. You have alcohol, but. Let me tell you so something. basically what I'm proposing is, you know, since I'm going to be here full time, right, I'll continue to rent this through my business, Got it. right? Got it. So, Makes so, sense. so you're the sub, you're the sub lease. I, I'll become the sub that lease. Makes a lot of sense. Right. Because, because my company currently doesn't pay rent. I work in my home, so I'm going to open up an office here. So I can be here. That's different. In, That's different. Yeah. Well, yeah, no, then, no, you, then you get any stranger here. That's what that's what that's all concerns. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. No, no. That, that sounds, Another thing that sounds which like I want to I want to touch the topic of cutting off how we can either increase the revenue out of the space or cut the oh, cut that's, the cut that's the expense. I was wondering, are you paying right now somewhere else to store stuff? No, no, no. We we had no, no. We don't. But pay imagine anything. we order container. No, we need it. But guys, let me let me tell you something. Uh, what actually we discussed it today, and I was on the phone with uh, 